The Iranian regime is a danger internationally. It's a danger for the international security because the Iranian regime supports international terrorism. We know what happened in Beirut. Now we learn that through Hezbollah, who is uh, strongly supported by uh, Iran, even the chief of Hezbollah says that all their missiles come from Iran. Not only that, yeah, Iran violates constantly, every day, the human rights in his country. Uh, thousands of uh, political prisoners are tortured, many are killed, many others are abducted and brought to nobody knows where. It is something unacceptable. All the countries who have relationship with uh, Iran, diplomatic relationship, uh, economic relationship, should ask the regime to answer to these questions. Why don't you release political prisoners? Why you don't respect the chart of the United Nations, the Universal Declaration of the Human Rights? And if the regime, as it will not, doesn't answer, we need, we need, strongly need uh, sanctions to renew and uh, harden sanctions. I have questioned the Italian government about several things regarding Iran. Most of the times the Italian government is not responding, didn't answer about uh, the human rights violation, it didn't answer about the support to international terrorists, they only answered to me on one issue, the renewal that has been requested by the United States of America, the renewal of the weapon embargo. But what did the Italian government say? They didn't say that they will support the renewal or they will vote against. They didn't say anything. This is unacceptable. We have to ask all the democratic countries, all the citizens of the democratic countries must ask their own governments to stand for freedom to stand for democracy. If we don't protect democracy in Iran, where there is not, we, if we don't protect human rights in Iran and in the countries where Iran is trying to enter with its uh, political and terrorist ties, we are not supporting freedom and democracy in our country. Let's stand with Iran. Let's stand with uh, the movement led by Mariam Rajavi, an extraordinary woman, extraordinary freedom fighter. Let's stand with those thousands of prisoners who are enduring torture, detention, the breaking of their families. Let's stand with them, let's stand for freedom.